What's up, everybody? My name is Jason, and welcome to Small Biz. In today's video, we're going to talk about how a red hot jobs number initially sent the NASDAQ sky high, with NVIDIA getting close to a thousand points before it dropped almost a hundred in less than one hour. So, the obvious question of this day is Did we just witness the top in the stock market? And is it really true that we racked up another 41% profit? in a biotech stock. All that and more coming out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, TGIF. By the way, I just did arguably one of the most intense videos I ever did. I think it was about seven and a half minutes long, but the ending, and you might want to stick around for that, was so loud that it crashed the software. It's happened a time or two. So I'm going to consider that's God's way of telling me to dial it back just a little bit. Because you know I can be slightly obnoxious, I was probably extremely obnoxious. Let me simply say the following, and I'll get you out of here in less than 10 minutes. I have been warning people for weeks that the stock market was dangerously overbought. Last trade on NVIDIA, 885. That's down about 100 bucks in the last hour and a half. I was saying that the RSI in these stocks, like SMCI and others, you're talking about over 95. You're talking about once in a lifetime nosebleed type uh, scenarios. It wasn't going to last. And I kept telling folks inside of the Discord, pay attention to Bitcoin, pay attention to Bitcoin. But I had my head in the guillotine. As you know, I didn't think we were going to go over 69,000. And we did for about 10 minutes. And then boom, there was the warning. There was the shot across the bow. That was the risk off moment. And while NVIDIA is going to try like hell to fight back, the 50 day moving average on the stock is 661. The uh, 200 day is 497. It is still, despite dropping a hundred bucks from its high this morning, way overbought. So I'm going to emphasize what I've been saying now for almost a month. Most of the market, particularly mega cap tech, Meta, uh, Microsoft, NVIDIA just topped. You're not going to see a 980 on NVIDIA for several months. I think we're going to go through a sideways to down cycle for most of the market into the spring, early summer. The Fed's going to start cutting probably June, July, because the number today on the jobs was so very strong. And then you'll get your typical rally in the fourth quarter, particularly if you know who reclaims office, because what I watched last night was the most motherfucking disgraceful State of the Union in U.S. history. And while we don't, and I mean we don't bring politics inside of the Discord, and I did promise my late mother, rest her soul, that I would never say fuck Joe Biden again in writing, I was biting a hole through my tongue. He's jacked up on Adderall, cocaine, caffeine, whatever the hell it was they gave him. And he's screaming at people, no unification. Starts off with Ukraine. Are you motherfucking shitting me? So I said, I'm going to say it again right now, and I'm probably going to lose some business for it. I have the utmost respect for you if you're a Democrat. You have the right as I have. I voted for Bill Clinton as one example to vote for the best candidate that you believe is uh, due to take office, be it left, center, or right. But if you, yeah, you watching me right now, still after what we watched last night support Joe Biden, if you're going to gladly go in there and pull the lever for that motherfucker, I want you to do me a favor. You go to shopsmallbiz.com. You cancel your account. And I'll tell you what, for the next 24 hours, if you pay by the month, I'll give you a refund. But you got to write me a note and say, I'm a flaming Democrat and I want my money back. You can kiss my ass, go fuck yourself, whatever you got to say. So for the next 24 hours, any Democrat that wants to cancel, that's still going to support that piece of motherfucking shit, I will give a refund to. We have a 93% win rate. I'll be 54 years old in April. I've reached a point in my life where I just don't give a fuck anymore. I'm going to swing from the hip. I'm going to shoot from the hip. I'm going to do what I do best. My middle name is Aries. I can be very intense. I'm like a bull in a china shop. But I love and I fight very intensely. Especially for those of you that I care about. No one's going to fucking come into our house, the Discord, and tell me how to run the show. I have taken 30 years 
all the slings and arrows to finally figure out how to stack cash to the ceiling. And if you're following my advice and you're putting about 80% of your money, marrying it to the market and your retirement accounts inside of e index funds or ETFs like SPY, QQQ, and IWM, that you're, then you're at an all-time high as of this correction this morning. And when you consider over 250 winners in the last two years, and the fact that I've been right a staggeringly 93% of the time with the two M stocks, probably the only names that you could give me in terms of a loss, it is an astronomical rate of return. And anyone who's going to quit or ask for their money back or has done in the, in the past has made the biggest financial mistake of their entire life because I can not only help you make, but save money. How many times have you seen me not only rack up a 41% winner in ATXI, in at 13, out at 18 and change, but save someone from diving in to a minus 70, minus 80, minus uh, a 90 some odd percent cesspool. Is it such a thing? Quicksand. Pile of shit. Take your pick. Time and again. So in closing, if you cannot take any direction, if you cannot handle my personality, if you're a flaming fucking liberal who can actually say with a straight face that Joe Biden is doing a great job, kiss my motherfucking ass and ask for a refund. The rest of you that understand I am a independent, uh, uh, hardcore loving American who wants to help everyone regardless of skin, race, color, creed. I don't care who you're sleeping with or who you're even voting for. I'll do everything in my power to help your small business and your retirement accounts and your trading account go to a whole new level. So until next time, always remember in a rather bizarre video that I love you. I truly do. And thank you so much for watching. Dial it back just a little bit. Even though I just spent a week on a Caribbean cruise to Honduras, Belize, and Cozumel, you can motherfucking bet that when the sun goes down tonight, it's going to be a motherfucking white G night.